So was there a point where you just realized, okay, I, if whatever I'm giving my yes to outside of my family means I'm giving my no to my family. So how did you differentiate what to say yes to? And how did you make those decisions? I really believe in seasons. Mm -hmm. um, you know, you, you said you're in your 30s and in the season of your 30s for most women, it's when they're getting really established. You know, they, they may be getting married, they're having their kids, mm -hmm. launching career. And it's a super intense season of life. And I really think that there's some things you can't do. Right. I, I think it's a myth that, that, that any person, not just a woman, I don't think there's man or woman who can have it all, all the time right, right now. Right. And when that's our goal, something is always gonna suffer. You're gonna skim somewhere mm -hmm. and you gotta figure out where it is you're gonna skim. And it better not be you know, your family right. and your, your relationship with God. Mm -hmm. um, and so just realizing that life comes through seasons. And for me in my 60s, I'm in a different season. I've got some freedom that you don't have right now. Mm -hmm. I don't have little people crawling over me sure. every morning <laughs> demanding breakfast, you know? Yeah, that's, uh, that's my life right now. <laughs> it's a totally different season. I'm yeah. not taking kids to lessons and sure. doing homework. And so there's a freedom that I have right now. The temptation for, for women in my season of life is to go, man, I've been there, done that. Sure. I, I'm not serving anymore. I, I'm, you know, I've, I've done that. I'm not working in the church nursery again, or <laughs> I'm not. And it's for me to realize, no, there are women coming up behind me mm -hmm. who are looking for role models, who are looking for mm -hmm. people. As you're saying, tell me, how mm -hmm. did you survive this? Mm -hmm. For women in your stage of life and even into the forties, um, I just think there's a recognition of it's okay to say no yeah. to some things, to know that there are. this is a season in some ways of preparation, um, that, that God is planting seeds for the next season. Right. And so each season has opportunities. You have opportunities I don't have. You get to have those sweet little kisses on your face, even as they're driving you crazy. Those, those sweet little kisses and sticky fingers, yeah. that is it's precious. Yeah, I don't have right. that. Mm. But you have also limitations that mm -hmm. I don't have. So mm -hmm. looking at life through the seasons, knowing that every season has opportunities and limitations, being patient with the limitations mm -hmm. and grateful for the opportunities um, and just realize it's never gonna, it won't stay the way it is right now. Right. It's not gonna stay the way it is for me. Life is continually moving. So adjusting to the season that you're in is mm. probably one of the best lessons I learned as a, as a young mom. That's such good advice. Thank you for saying that. <laughs>